Um, well, here I am. I'm at home when I would normally be at work today. I got sent home yesterday with burnout. Um, it's a big thing in my industry at the moment. Um, I'm definitely not alone in feeling it. I'm not quite sure what to do next. I contacted the local um, mental health support people, which was something that the autism psychologist suggested that I should have done anyway. Um, so I contacted them a little while ago. They phoned me while I was at work last week and I couldn't face phoning them back, but yesterday I forced myself to. Um, and they actually had a cancellation, which meant I got to do the, the initial assessment appointment there and then, or you know, later than yesterday. So I've got some mental health support coming. I didn't feel especially listened to. I'm feeling very awkward and heavy at the moment. Um, I wanted to talk earlier, but it's like my lips were glued together. I'm feeling very aware of noise at the moment. Um, there's a lot of insects running around at my feet. A little spider right by me. Some baby wood lice and an ant. Some other stuff I don't recognise, and it's. I'm just very aware of everything at the moment. There's a plane overhead that can hear the pigeons flapping their wings, the birds singing and squawking, someone mowing their lawn. Um, my brain's having even more trouble than normal working out which sounds are important and which ones are just background noise that can be ignored. I'm wearing my sunglasses, I'm having that thought I sometimes have where. I wonder if the world when I'm wearing my sunglasses is how it is to people, other people daily. I've always, or well, I've known for a long time that I'm more sensitive to light than other people. I see better in the dark than other people. Um, I thought it was linked with the, the fibromyalgia and the hypersensitivity to external stimuli you get there. But my sister's the same and she doesn't have fibromyalgia, but she's neurodiverse in her own way, she's got dyslexia and uh, yeah, I'm just feeling a bit, I'm not sure what the best way forward is at the moment and I'm feeling really sad because I was towards the end of last week starting to prepare a video about circus and why it works so well for me. Um, And talking about the things that I'm passionate about, wanting to make some videos about my special interests and about ways I stim and stuff that makes me feel good. And at the moment, I just can't. And yeah, I'm feeling very trapped, and I'm not sure how to get through this really. Um, and the worst bit is I'm not alone, you know? A lot of people feel like this at the moment. Society needs to change and I don't know how to fix that. Anyway, that's kind of where I am today and it's why there's not been as many videos recently. And I mean, I always knew the pace I was doing to begin with wasn't going to last. I don't know what pace I want to do then, but I hope you can actually hear me. I'm aware I'm very quiet. Anyway, we'll see. I'll talk to you again. Bye.